Hello everyone, I'm Lorenzo Grassi and I'm going to briefly present this paper about the uh, security of truncated permutation without uh, initial value. So a very brief uh, motivation and overview of this uh, work. Um, it is well known that the uh, truncated permutation applied to the concatenation of an input value with a fixed initial value is indifferentiable from a random function up to a certain bound. In this paper, we prove that uh, almost the same bound holds if the fixed value is replaced by a randomized value. And based on this, we propose some concrete application in the context of parallel viable length adjust generation. Um, so in a bit more details, our goal is to set up a construction that allows for uh, efficient parallel digest generation. And the reason of this is that um, uh, evaluating several permutations simultaneously in modern CPU is faster than evaluating them in sequence. Now, in the case of uh, PRF, this goal can be achieved by making use, for example, of the Farfalle construction proposed by Bertoni et al. Uh, in 2017. In the case of Eshing, um, this goal can be achieved by making use of the mask generation functions. For example, here we have the chain MGF construction, uh, which is defined in this way. So we have a function, uh, hash function h, we return an output uh, of a fixed output length. Um, and the construction is defined as uh, a one way function applied to, concat to the concatenation of the output of this hash function with an index i. Um, so there are several ways to set up this uh, one-way function, and one possibility is making use of a uh, truncate, um, truncated function. Um, so the, trunca the, the truncation function takes an input uh, p minus m bits and return n bit, and this is defined in the following way. Um, so we take an initial value of m bits and we concatenate it with the input uh, x of this truncation function. Then we apply a permutation to this concatenation, uh, that is the final b bits, and finally uh, we truncate uh, um, the output of this uh, permutation. So we just return the n uh, leftmost bits. Uh, at Asia Crypt 2019, um, Choyeto proved that um, this construction is indifferentiable from a random function up to a certain number of queries, uh, which is given by this bound. So I'm not going into the details, I just would like to point out. Uh, this vector to the power of m, where m is the size of the initial value. For example, if m is equal to 0, then this number is equal to 1, which means that this construction is uh, easily, um, you can easily differentiate this function from uh, a random function. Um, so, the initial value is crucial for the indifferentiability, but at the same time it is overkill because uh, um, there are some uh, scenarios where we can prove that um, um, this construction is secure even, if, even without this fixed initial value. And this is exactly what we do in this paper. So we consider a modified version of this uh, truncation function where we replace the fixed initial value with a randomized one. So we define this uh, randomized trunca truncation construction that takes an input two uh, element and an x and, and uh, which is defined in this way. So first of all we apply the hash function h to m, we concatenate the output of this um, hash function with the other input x, we apply the permutation p defined as before, and then we finally uh, truncate. So in the paper we proved that uh, this construction is indifferentiable from a random oracle up to a certain number of queries, and interesting, this number is very similar to the one proposed by Choyotoga 2019. Um, the main difference regard this uh, last vector that, as you can see, is uh, to the power of m alpha in this case, and the reason is that uh, uh, since, we are, since this value is not fixed, uh, we can potentially have a collision at the output of the hash function, so that's the reason of this uh, uh, fraction. Now, based on this, we propose uh, a new MGF construction, the cascade MGF construction, which is defined in this way. Um, so we basically concatenate the output of several randomized truncation construction, uh, which are applied uh, on a message m and on an index uh, i. Whereas before, the randomized truncation construction depends on a public random permutation p and on a fixed output length hash function h. Uh, not surprised, so this construction behaves as a variable output length 
Han Arkel, if H behave as a fixed output length Han Arkel. And uh, more interesting, in the paper we proved that this construction has concrete practical advantages with respect to other MGF construction, including counter MGF and chain MGF. Thank you very much for your, for your attention. If you are interested, I invite you to read our paper or to attend my presentation at Asia Crypt. Thank you again.